Hello everybody, my name is Tubus Fly and back with another thrift hunting video. Uh, today I am at a f Goodwill, no, Goodwill, Salvation Army, there we go. Um, this one is different from the other one I tried to go to, I don't know how long ago, a couple, few months ago, because um, this one actually has games and stuff. Um, I'm probably not going to be recording inside just because they're like right close to the checkout area and where the employees are and everything so i don't feel real great about recording inside so i will see you guys in a bit um i think maybe tomorrow i'll hit up goodwill i thought honestly i thought there was two goodwills in my area but there's only one because i drove by a plaza and it had a goodwill still on the marquee and it's not there anymore so uh, we'll hit up Goodwill tomorrow and uh, Salvation Army today, and I'll show you guys what I find, if anything. Okay, so I didn't find exactly anything real special. Um, they they normally do have like a good selection of games. This time around, they had a lot of sports games for the Xbox One, uh, some for 360, and then they had a good amount of Wii games and. They had, like, I think two PS2 games, and one of them being Final Fantasy twelve, I think. Um, and I thought about getting the twelve, and I'm like, eh, I don't know how well that would resell. But instead, I found something very unexpected. Um, but as a photographer, I immediately grew interest to it, and I have no idea what I'm doing here with it. Whoa, sun's not... Whoa. The sun's not going to help me today. Um, it's a Fuji film. So it's a waterproof quick snap Fuji film. I have no idea if it's just a disposable camera in a plastic case. If that's basically all it is. I want to get it open and see if I can just reload film in it. But I honestly have no idea. Um, it's something I'm going to have to look up when I get home, how to open and reload these, unless it is just a uh, one-time use camera. Well, <laughs> crap. It was three dollars. But wait, then how the, but then how do you open it though to get, develop the film? I honestly have, I don't know. I have no idea. I'm going to look this up. It says it's a one-time use camera. I don't know. I feel like, though, you should be able to put, like, any kind of disposable camera in this and it'd be waterproof, but I have no idea. I really wish I saw that. I <laughs> saw the, the fine print. Um... So yeah, that's gonna be it for today. I'm gonna hit up Goodwill tomorrow. Um, lately, they've been hit or miss. Um, so hopefully, we'll find something good tomorrow. See you then. All right. So now it is a new day because clearly I'm not wearing my college hat. Um, and say kind of different environment, maybe. Yeah. <laughs> so we're going into Goodwill. Um, not 100% sure if I'm going to be recording inside, just because it, when I said this in last month's video, I don't remember, that it's like, um, it's just going to be the same stock footage, but if I do find stuff that's interesting, I'll record and kind of point it out with my finger, so let's see what is in store for us today. So this video is going to be about all the unexpected things you can find thrift shopping. So yesterday... Again, full intention of finding video games and stuff. I feel like my hair is being weird. Um, had a, again, yesterday and today, full intention finding games and stuff. Um, and then I ended up finding an underwater camera yesterday. And uh, today it's another unexpected thing and I ended up buying. Um, the games were about the same as last time, mostly just sports games. There was uh, the Tony Hawk Skate It, I think it was called, something like that. I don't remember. 
But it's basically the one where you had to get, like, the... The cart... The skateboard that was basically, like, very unresponsive as hell. Um, the DVDs... Okay, so the DVDs, like, there were just... Um, somebody must have shipped off, like, their whole uh, Harry Potter collection because there was uh, DVDs of Chamber of Secrets, Prisoner of Azkaban, and I think Goblet of Fire or Order of Phoenix, and then there was a Blu-ray, there was Blu-ray special editions of um, Deathly House Part 1 and 2. I thought about getting them, and they're supposed to be marked, like DVDs and stuff, supposed to be marked at $1.99. I don't know what they're doing in Goodwill. They must be realizing that there's more to them than just, like, a disc. So they upped those to $3.99 a piece. And I I thought about getting them just so I can replace my Deathly House Part 1 and 2. But I, I don't know. But anyway. So today I bought a VR headset. Um, I already have one. However, it's a cardboard, Google Cardboard, and it's or like a third-party Google Cardboard, and it's not great. There was another one, there was another headset, and I ended up just buying this one instead. I, I don't know why, maybe just because it, something just fell. Maybe it's just because, um, that was a piece of the box. It doesn't have, like, the branding all over it. It's literally just, like, a gold-painted VR headset. So, yeah. And I didn't... I, I never knew this, just because I've had just a cardboard for a few years now. That, like, you can... There's, like, plates that shift, like, in the headset. So it can, like, fit your phone. That's pretty cool. So... But yeah, I'll have, to, um, I'll have to see if this works better than my cardboard. I already anticipate it well. And I bought it for 6 bucks. However, I'm just kind of... I don't know if it's their sticker or just when it was on retail. Um, take an additional 20% off lowest ticketed price. So, I don't know, again, if that was when it was retail or if it was just for them. I don't think it was. I could be wrong, though. So. But, yeah. Again, just unexpected things you find thrift shopping. So, that's going to be it for this, for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure to drop a like on this video and stay in tune with Let's Plays that are going on, future content like this, or movie reviews. I know... The time of this recording, it is the 30th of January, but it'll be going up for February's video, uh, since I do these monthly. Um, the next movie we'll be seeing is Birds of Prey, and I just had my friend text me about it last night, saying we're going to see Birds of Prey. Yup, and I'm buying, so. Otherwise, that's going to be it for this video. Again, hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure to drop a like on this video and to subscribe. For more content like this, otherwise, thank you everybody so much for watching, and I'll catch you guys next time.